great Grand Prix field to another great Grand Prix field. Uh, I guess what's the feeling of starting another tournament? I'm feeling great. I'm feeling superb. Just overall, yeah, great. Is it overwhelming to think about? I mean, you've got one fight in front of you, but there's a potential to have like multiple really tough fights ahead of you. Is that overwhelming at all to think about what it takes to win a tournament like this? No, it, instead it motivates me a lot. It just motivates me because uh, we have a lot of great fighters here, top talents, and it just motivates me to compete with them. Are there lessons that you can take out of previous Grand Prix experience? I mean, there's no like two fights in one night here, but are there lessons you can take out of going through something before? I've had tough fights in my previously in my career, but I've always showed grit and character and showed did whatever it takes to win and I'm planning to do the same in this tournament. I think for hardcore fight fans, this is the fight that everybody's looking forward to the most from people that really know the game. Maybe you're not the most famous name yet, but are you aware of that? And, and does that bring you pleasure to know that the hardcore fight fans are tuned into this fight? Yeah, it's time to change the game a little bit. Um, I'm uh, looking forward to this fight. It's a great fight. And I'm looking forward to put on a show, inshallah, for all the fans. And yeah, it's just uh, something that I look forward to, to represent my country at the highest level possible. Uh, I guess, can you talk specifically about the matchup itself? It does look very competitive on paper. What do you think of your opponent and, and kind of how your styles match up? Yeah, our styles are a little similar. Uh, that's why I think we got to do some adjustments to the game. Um, overall, I think it's uh, a good fight that expects us. Everyone has got their own plan. Uh, we've got our own plan that we need to execute. My plan is to finish it early. Last thing for me, I guess, what would it mean to win this Grand Prix? I mean, obviously, you'd be a champion. You'd be a million dollars richer, but you'd beat a lot of tough guys along the way. So what would it mean to walk away as a Grand Prix champion? First of all, thanks to Bellator for giving me this opportunity to participate in such a massive tournament. Uh, I feel honored to be one of those eight fighters to be uh, to be shortlisted. And uh, it also gives me a lot of pleasure to know that I'm the first Azerbaijani athlete to be participating 
in such a massive tournament. So it, this is, uh, event by itself is already historical to me and I love this opportunity. Thank you. Ve ben sen bu yere gelip satmağımda en büyük emeği olan öz mühkün özlerine teşekkür ederim. Ruslan Efendi'ye ve be, bizim kollektivde yani öz komandama derin teşekkür ederim. Kimler kime desteği olur, mühkün meziyetimi seçir. Yani onların sayesinde ben burada. And first and foremost, I want to thank my head coach, Ruslan Efendiyev, who has an immense uh, job uh, in me being here. Uh, I want to thank all my team, all my teammates, who also put a lot of effort for me to be on the stage and participate in this tournament. Not that you were, uh, you know, unknown when you came to Bellator, but you might not have been a household name to a lot of Bellator fans. So how big was it? that you got such a quick knockout in, in your first fight here? Tabii ki, yani ilk debut döyüşü vaxtından tez kutardıq. Yani buna bakmayalım. Artık ben çalışıram ki, yani bu təşkilatda maraqlı döyüş gösterip ve özümün məxsus burada publika yığmaq. Yeah, of course, it's, it's a great feeling to uh, finish your first fight and that fast. Uh, my goal here is to come to perform for the fans, to show great fights, to win, to win audience here. And that's what I'm looking forward to doing. Uh, it's a great feeling. Do you feel like that gives him any kind of a, a, a mental edge in the tournament because there's seven other guys in there who know, oh man, this guy can put my lights out in 27 seconds if he if he needs to? Ben sen fergelemir orada olan gitti ne ferdi? Yani ben buraya gelmişen. Özgüdümü göstermeye ve çalışı bu Grand Prix'nin galibi olmalı. Ben danışmağa sözünü vermiyorum. Çalışıyorum ki her şey sözünü yok, emelli. I don't like talking too much. I don't care about the other seven guys in the tournament. I'm here to show my strength, to show who I am. And my uh, my I'm, my job is going to do the talking, not my words. Because of that, does he even care who he might have to fight next uh, from the other fight in on his half of the bracket? In general, I think I know who I am. But in this case, we are in the plan of the fight. I mean, I was in the plan of the fight. I was in the plan of the fight. I was in the plan of the fight. I I know approximately who I'm going to be fighting, so I have my own plan, uh, the plan of actions, plan of movement. So, yeah, I approximately know what's going to, what's coming next. So I'm just looking forward to it. Hey, Tofik, uh, you know it's been a great career so far, and this is a very big moment getting to be a part of the tournament. I'm curious when you kind of reflect on things and look at, you know, when you started your career, is this about the timing and speed you expected to be, you know, participating in a big tournament like this? You know, Tabich and Ibu. Kariyeramın belediyeydi. Artık benim kariyerimde bir Grand Prix oldu ve bu ikinci Grand Prix'di. Ona bakmayalım yani benim için gurur verirsiniz ki bu iki gün burada yani Belatol için böyle teşkilatlı bir Grand Prix'de özgürlüğüme sanıyorum. Ve gelecekte maraqlı olardı ki Belatol UFC'ye karşı 70 kilo 8 derecesinde biz Belatol'un 70 kilosu olarak UFC'nin 70 yollarına karşı dövüşmeye daha maraqlı olardı.
it's not my first Grand Prix, it's my second Grand Prix, but uh, it's great. It's a great feeling to be in Bellator's Grand Prix. Uh, one thing that I want to mention that I'm looking forward to in the future is maybe doing a Grand Prix between uh, Bellator 70 kilogram fighters against UFC 70 kilogram fighters. I think it would be an exciting event and I would love to see that in my career. Yeah, that'd be very cool, man. Well, best of luck. So Tofik, you kind of just touched on it. This isn't your first World Grand Prix. This is your second. You won the other one. Do, do you feel that gives you an advantage over your competition? I think so too. Okay. Uh, so you just touched on it. This is your second World Grand Prix. Do you feel that gives you an advantage over your competitors who maybe don't know the scheduling and what's in store for them? Yeni mən həyatında olan qalibiyyətləri, e, həyatında olan Grand Prix-ləri yadımda saxlamıram. Yəni artıq mən o e, ringdən, o setkana, o Grand Prix-in qalib olaramsa, tərk edirəmsə, artıq mən o yaxtdan çıxardıram. Mən qabağa baxıram, çalışıram. Yəni o şeylərini yaşamıram mən. I don't live with things in the past. When one Grand Prix was over, it's already for in the past for me. I don't think about it. I only look forward. And that's what my main concern is. And it's been close to a year to the day that you signed with the promotion. How would you rate your first year with Bellator? I, I hear you bad. What was the question again? Do you want me to say it in here? Like, yeah. Um, he signed with Bellator close to a year ago today. How would he rate the first year with Bellator? Tabii ki, birinci debut döyüşüm oldu. Ona bakmayarak, yani reyting de bir de gelirdi. Ve artık ben kemer döyüş üzerinde buluşmalıydım. Ona bakmayarak, bir bazı oyunlar değişti. Ben kemer döyüşünün zamanında kaldım. Osman Vurşası oldu döyüşü. Ama buna bakmayarak, ben hemşe hazırım kemer buluşmaya. Ama isteyelim ki benim tarihimde Bellator'da yani kemer dövüşüm, vuruşum. I came to this organization, I fought the number one contender. In my opinion, I should have fought the champion who, uh, who was Patrick at the time. But then some games changed and Usman got the opportunity to fight for the belt. Um, of course, I would love to fight for the belt. And I really want to have that in my legacy, in my history, that I fought for Bellator Championship, for the Bellator belt.